so today I've come back to this uh, uh, customer in like in China. Um, they are a small customer, like they have a very uh, small production line with um, uh, water treatment. So this is raw water, this is the water treatment, and this um, uh, deionized water, and this is one uh, small mixer. Okay, um, this is another small mixer for glass cleaner, floor cleaner, and stuff. So now this one is the um, the dosing machine. Okay, so those the, this dosing machine is uh, dosing machine is um, uh, made of uh, uh, many two parts. So this one uh, scale, the scale, and this uh, dosing machine. The um, it's controlled by this. Um, uh, it's powered by this um, the pump. Okay, this pump and this um, PLC controller, and this um, valves, this uh, seal article, I don't know how to, how, how to describe it, this one, this valves, okay, uh, by uh, compressed air. So now, this uh, scale, okay, we have some chemicals on the scales, and um, we have four, now we have uh, this one, uh, this uh, scale can be customized. Okay, we can make it bigger to hold uh, five, six, seven, even eight uh, chemicals. But for now, this one is a smaller one uh, for four chemicals. Okay, SLS, LAPSA, CDA, and AO9. Okay, so we can make it bigger to have um, a place, have enough place for uh, seven, eight different chemicals. Okay, so now this um, dosing machine is um, so basically it's uh, the scale will send the signal signal of the weight of what's on the scale. Okay, so now uh, the total weight of the chemicals and the, the barrels. <laughs> on the scale is 400, uh, 400 and uh, 1.5 kilo. Okay, so <laughs> now let, let's start start the process. <laughs> For example, so now uh, the first um, uh, chemicals that we're gonna dose into the mixer is uh, let's say lapsa. Okay, so so this one is lapsa. So as for the formulation, suppose we're gonna add, uh, uh, let's say, uh, 30, uh, oh, let's say maybe 20 kilo of uh, lapsa, okay? So 20 kilo of lapsa, and uh, we just open this valve, okay? And uh, we start, uh, so it will start uh, pumping uh, lapsa into the mixer so okay so it's up in his 20 kilo but actually uh, so so now the total weight of the chemicals now on the plate is uh, 382.5 so 20 kilo was uh, <coughs> deducted was pumped Okay, uh, from the barrel, but but uh, as you can see, still some of the uh, some of the elapsa stays in the pap in the pipeline. Okay, stays in the pipeline. Uh, it doesn't like complete. It doesn't uh, uh, in, uh, goes into the mixer completely. So what we're gonna do? Uh, we have one line uh, to pump water okay so we can uh, pump uh, water so this uh, line is pumping deionized water directly from the so so now uh, the water will push the lapsa that stays in the pipeline into the mixer okay so see now there's a foam Okay, so after some time, you see there's uh, the uh, water 
is coming out of the pipeline is uh, clear. It means now all the lapsa has been uh, pushed into the mixer and now it's, wa it's just water, okay? And um, so what we're gonna do uh, so laps, it means that uh, total 20 kilo of lapsa has been uh, pumped into this mixer. But, <coughs> but also some, some of the water, because you know, we use some water to pump and uh, to push the lapsa into the mixer. So we don't know how much uh, water has been uh, used to push into this uh, uh, mixer. Uh, so this customer, they, uh, you know, they are, uh, they don't care because uh, for each of the batch, uh, they are making one uh, ton of uh, detergent, okay. So what they're gonna do, um, they, for now, at this moment, they don't, they don't calculate how much water has been pumped okay, into the mixer. So what they do, at the end, they will, uh, they will like, you know, check, uh, they will see the, the total amount of uh, detergent, like to see this, uh, the level. Okay, they they have one, uh, uh, they have one. Um, uh, this sound, uh, how do this uh, observation um, part to see the total amount of detergent. Okay, so <laughs> to calculate the total amount of uh, water uh, has been used. But for us, uh, we plan to have one uh, a scale. We, we plan to have one scale. Um, uh, uh, this um, under this uh, mixer, okay. So this scale will be uh, 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 was <laughs> it will gi it will give you it will tell you the it will tell you the the total amount of water has been pumped has been used, okay. So now let's start. Um, pumping uh, uh, AS, SLS into the uh, mixer. So suppose we're gonna have uh, 40 kilo of SLS. <laughs> so we just, <laughs> so now this pipeline uh, for SLS has been um, um, like opened. We just start. So, so SLS is coming in. As you can see, so so uh, actually because um, uh, this uh, customer uh, they have been waiting for the SLS, so we are using the uh, <laughs> the same uh, material to uh, uh, simulating the SLS. Okay, so it's, as you can see, it's very fast. It's only taking like a few seconds to finish pumping SLS into the mixer. Okay, so now um, in this case, later we, we don't need to, uh, we can, so still some of the SLS still stays in the, in the pipeline. Okay, so now we can do the same. We pump water, okay, um, to push all the less SLS into this uh, mixer, okay? But we can also um, uh, do another, in another way that we uh, start pl pumping uh, CDA, let's say CDA, okay? Uh, to push, okay, we can use the CDA to push the SLS stays in the pipeline into the mixer. Okay, so now let's say uh, we're gonna have 15 kilo of uh, CDA. Okay, so we we'll start uh, pumping as uh, CDA. <laughs> so, so now the CDA is coming into the, the dosing machine in the pipeline. It will push um, the SLS into this um, mixer. And then we can continue the process. Um, okay, we're gonna we're gonna now we're gonna uh, pump A O nine. Um, let's say we're gonna have uh, ten kilo of A O nine, and uh, <laughs> so with A O nine, it will. 
see it's very fast. Okay, very fast. So after all this um, chemicals has been um, uh, pumped uh, from the barrel, okay, from the barrel. Uh, so the last step is to again to uh, pump water, uh, deionized water, to push all those chemicals that stays in the uh, pipeline, okay, from the um, from this wharf. Uh, until the mixer, okay, there's a, um, there's some chemical stays in, to, in this uh, uh, pipeline um, from the, the dosing machine until this uh, mixer, okay. So we need to pump water to push all these chemicals into this mixer, okay. We just See, at the beginning, because of the chem some of the chemicals, uh, you can see uh, the foam, okay? But after some time, uh, it's now the, what's coming out of the pipeline is becoming clear. It means that all the chemicals has been pushed into this mixer. And uh, now it's only water is coming from the pipeline into the mixer, okay? So basically, the process is... And... So the basic, um, in general, in general, the basically, uh, basically, the, the, the whole process is gonna be um, at the very beginning, uh, we're gonna add uh, some water, like maybe um, <laughs> maybe if sixty percent of the water, okay, uh, we're gonna pump the base water, the base water. I mean the around sixty percent of the total water into the formula. Uh, <coughs> so we're gonna pump this base water into the mixer first, and then we start uh, adding. EDTA and uh, caustic soda, you know, and and then after this uh, uh, dissolution, uh, dissolving uh, EDTA and uh, caustic soda, and then we're gonna pump lapsa uh, from the barrel into the mixer. Okay, after we pump this uh, lapsa, uh, make sure we uh, pump water. Okay, to push all the lapsa that stays in the pipeline into the mixer so that the lapsa can uh, uh, be neutralized, okay, with the caustic soda, okay, like completely, okay. And then uh, we're gonna pump uh, SLS and CTA and CAB and uh, AO9, like in order, one by one. And, and for those, uh, we don't need to, you know, use water uh, to push the chemicals in that stays in the pipeline into the mixer every time. We don't need to. We just need to, at the end of the uh, at the end of the the dosing of all the chemicals. We just need to, uh, to use one time, you know, uh, to use water to pump uh, to push uh, the chemicals stays in the pipeline into the mixer for one time. Okay. And uh, and suppose during this uh, dosing uh, process, we have used maybe around uh, 40 kilo of uh, deionized water, okay? Plus the base water that we have uh, dosed into the mix at the very beginning, and say maybe around uh, 80% of water has been dosed, okay? So now, um, uh, as, as I said, we plan to have one uh, scale uh, here uh, at the bottom of the, the mixer. So we're gonna see, like, uh, to, we, can, we, 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 we can see how, <laughs> like how much, uh, how many kilo of uh, materials, including water and chemicals, has been dosed in total into the mixer. And we need to see how much more water 
okay, to um, add it, to be added into the mixer to make it 100%, uh, like to make it the complete formula, okay? So after that, we're gonna test the pH and, and stuff, and then we add uh, uh, flag lens and uh, preservatives and, and, and stuff. Okay, so that's the, basically that's the uh, general <laughs> process of the, uh, the detergent making uh, process.